Okay, first off, you know that we have finished this room. We also did this wall over here. So this is done. And we also finished this kitchen area. So we did that wall, this wall, this wall, and obviously the ceiling all the way across. So this part is done. But on top of that, over here, we also finished the hallway. This entire hallway is done. Now we don't have lights in here yet or anything, but everything here is also done. So that's really good, right? So all that we have left is this back room, which is where the washer and dryer is gonna be. We have to do the ceiling with insulation. We have to finish that back wall. But like this wall is ready. Um, and then the bathroom over here, um, what we got going on, we have a lot going on here. So, so she spent all day yesterday working on the insulation here and here. She's a little bit on the ceiling. And then in that time lapse in the last video, we built the shower, right? So it's a huge built-in shower, right? And we're gonna tile it from the bottom to the ceiling in tile. And we're just gonna never have to worry about it again. And we got what we wanted. We wanted, I wanted two shower heads, you know, with two controls so we can have our own his and her kind of shower. And uh, this thing is massive. It's really big. But the, the bathroom itself is really big, so it, it, it kind of all just works out. Also, we should go upstairs real fast. Let me show you something. And as you can see up here, we have some of these plastic things in the ceiling, right? So these things actually help the roof to breathe. So the air from the outside will flow through this and out into this space over here. So when the winter rolls around and it's really warm in here, but it's really cold on top of the ceiling, like on the roof, um, moisture won't build up underneath this wood and to damage it and all that kind of thing. So. I spent a lot of time putting this stuff in and also had to drill holes to the outside. That's where you can see little holes here. Uh, and that has, been, that has been a huge pain, but I'm pretty much done. I do need to do this entire side behind this wall. So with that, that's kind of where we are with the whole build and everything. Like the video that you watched last time, this is the very next day. So this is where we are in this moment in time. Um, obviously by the end of the video, we'll be somewhere else, but this is where we are. So today we're gonna work on putting insulation in the bathroom and then we're gonna put drywall up. That's, that's hopefully what we can get done. And there's a lot of things that have been happening behind the scenes that are just kind of coming out of nowhere or whatnot. I think we don't have enough drywall to do the entire building. Like we might have enough to do upstairs, but we don't know. I don't know how much we're gonna have for the back room. For those that don't know, what is happening here is he was moving the pipe over because it was too close to the bathroom vanity. So we had to cut this out and then move it and it was it was a lot more work than we thought, but it's done now. No one will ever know. Okay, brand new day. There's a lot of things going on today. We actually have the guy here that is going to mud all of our walls. So that's really exciting. He's gonna be here for like the next two weeks. So hopefully I'll be able to film him do his job and that kind of stuff. Me and Laura right now need to go upstairs and finish the installation um, for up there so we can start to move the drywall that we brought in earlier that you saw me and dad brought in. We had to buy more drywall. We ran out of materials. So that was kind of like a, a thing we weren't prepared for, but you know, you have to do what you gotta do. So he's here, we need to finish so you can be able to mud upstairs too and we can get the whole house done. Yeah, and it's supposed to be like 90 degrees today, so hopefully we don't die of heat stroke. But outside of that, it's gonna be a blessed day. Let's get started.
Well, hello. Just wanted to give you an update as it stands right now. I know I'm wearing my sunglasses. Don't worry about that. It, I wear a prescription. This is, it's just easier to do this way. Now, me and Laura have to go on a short tour. Okay, so from right down this moment, tomorrow morning, Thursday, we're going to be gone for uh, about a week and a half. So we got to go down to Oregon to do a, a concert this Sabbath. And then next week, uh, next weekend, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, we have a camp meeting. So we're going to be gone for a little while. But I wanted to give you a full update here to let you know just where we are with the build. So as it stands right now in this moment, everything in the house right now has been at least mudded one time. I think he's on a second coat. Some places here, it might be a little bit more in this living room, he's on a second coat. Um, but all upstairs, as you guys saw in this video, it's all drywalled and has the first layer of mud on it. So that's kind of where we're at right now. But also, simultaneously, as all of that is happening, we actually have a guy here that is leveling out the septic field. And I'll show you some clips of that on my drone. Um, kind of came out of left field, just providential, kind of happened. Uh, super interesting how that happened. Maybe you can ask me sometime and I'll tell you the story. Um, but we leave tomorrow, so I'm gonna have to abandon this and let them just do their job, let him do his job. It's the same guy that helped us with the septic tank, so how ironic that everything's full circle, having the same people involved, the entire project all the way through. With that said, the house is looking really good. Still have a long way to go. I mean, we gotta get floors, we gotta get tile, we have to do all the other stuff, we still need to sand our cabinets, we haven't even done that. So we're behind, but we're also way more ahead than we thought we would be today. So we're excited, and uh, we're also excited to get back on the road. So let's get there, just wanted to show you this. And with that, I'm going to end the video here. Me and Laura are already on our tour. Last Sabbath we had a concert. We're looking forward to the camp meeting that's happening in about two days. That's like a Thursday, Friday, Saturday thing, so we should be home by Monday. We just got a phone call not that long ago from, our, uh, from the family that said that the guy that's doing all the mudding has one more coat pretty much on the entire house and then he's completely done. They sent us some pictures of the septic tank of how it's nice and leveled out. So when we get there, I'll show you in person because I want to get some like really nice shots of it and that kind of thing. Um, but for us being gone and us being on tour, so much work was done. So much of it is is just we're excited too. We can't we get can't wait to get home. So with that, I just want to let you guys know. Also, we might drop a music video sometime pretty relatively soon. So that's really exciting. And uh, yeah, thanks for being on this journey. I can't wait for what's next, which is probably more work but it's gonna look really good.